What is cracking guys? <sighs> I don't explain how pumped I am. I'm super pumped. Like, like super pumped. I don't know why though, but I'm just like super. I don't know. I'm just like, I feel like I'm ready to go out and just kill it. Like, make a shit ton of money today. But, uh, haha. <laughs> I was really pumped before getting this up, but now I don't know what to say. It was mostly just a rant about how pumped I am. I'm gonna set the day off with a killer workout. So, you know what? Let's, let's just, let's just get to the gym. Hi, Mia. How are you? Okay, so remember a few days ago when I was borrowing a camera from a buddy of mine to shoot uh, the two videos for Street Culture and then I returned it to him later that evening because he had to film for the Indian film project. Well, I forgot to return his lens cap, so I'm gonna go do that now and head straight to the gym! I know that I'm, uh, I'm a little extra pumped today, but I really like it when this happens because I usually end up getting something productive done. Which is something that I really need right now. <laughs> I just left from my home, I'm coming to give you the landscape. Yes, sir. Oh, shit. Okay, I'll come to your room. No worry. Just, uh, I think I'll, yeah, yeah, yeah. For, I know, I know the way, I know the way. No worries. Yeah. I'll be down in like four minutes. Okay, I'm here waiting for Hani to get down. Look at Hani. Sweet dad. Now, I don't know whether there's two gates to his building. I'm just waiting between the both of them. I want to show off. It's the smartest thing to do. I hope it is. <laughs> What's up, Hani? What's up? Thank you so much, man. Okay, I'm at the gym now. I don't think I've spoken about this before. My gym is a lot more than a gym. It's it's one of India's fastest growing startups right now. I felt, it was, I felt it's about time I told you a little bit about Multifit. Hello, Eddie. Quick warm up, skipping, and uh, I think I'll do back and biceps today. But I'm gonna ask Raj. This is a good workout. Ask Raj. What if it's way more than just a gym? The premise with the whole. Act company was to run a gym which focuses more on natural fitness kind of sort of like crossfit but more trainer intensive and more more bodybuild I, i'm not too sure but the idea was to improve the quality of fitness education in the country and they've been doing phenomenally i think they've been open about three years now and they have like i think they've got multi in like 10 cities across the country and like in the past year alone i think they opened like 15 franchises which is not a joke it's it's insane some doctors I mean, Kapoor, the founder, is a bloody genius. He's built a huge empire and, and the company is growing so rapidly right now. I'm pretty sure they've been featured in multiple newspapers or multiple news channels and all of them term was one of India's fastest growing startups. It's great. So if you're wondering why I'm so loyal to the company, it's a lot more than just the gym to me too. I'm loyal to the idea and the construct in itself. Just wrapped a sick back bicep and ab workout. I'm really happy to be finally getting back into the ground and doing this full long ass workout. Because there was this whole break that happened after I got into that uh, six week program but I was doing only those and then after that I never really got back into the flow and now I'm trying to get back into it and cut down and build up all over again. I might get back to that routine though. Got home and something else was in the mail. You can see Mia here, but what you probably can't is the 
boost. Are they Yeezys? Me, I got The delivery service has totally messed up the box and it's so hurtful. Totally ruined the whole Kanye West unboxing experience. <laughs> A buddy of mine sent them over from Delhi. And uh... Whew. There's the bill for the legitimacy. And... Oh boy. Beautiful, beautiful cream white shoes. Oh my lord. Oh my god, they're so much prettier than I thought. <gasps> so, so goddamn beautiful. There's the Yeezy Boost 350 V2 cream whites and they are so, so goddamn beautiful. Oh my god. Uh, unfortunately, again, they're not for me, they're for a friend. I would kill to keep them, but I cannot afford to spend that kind of money on shoes right now. It sucks. But what I can do, have a pair of Yeezys hanging around my neck and every opportunity I get to do that, I'm going to just for the heck of it and to get like a cool thumbnail out of it. But I feel like it's this is such an underrated shoe right now. I'm just gonna make like a thumbnail out of this. It's such an underrated shoe in my opinion. I mean, the color is so beautifully pure. I feel because the... so. If you're not familiar with what Yeezys are, the Kanye West infamous collaboration with Adidas. Kanye West is an American hip-hop artist who is one of the greatest of all time in my opinion. I absolutely love him, his music, his craziness, his, his attitude. I think it's, it's, it's amazing. And he was designing with Nike, but Nike didn't give him enough creative freedom. So he bounced and partnered with Adidas to release the Yeezys. The model behind the Yeezys was to release a limited quantity and create a huge, huge demand which was goddamn genius so the hype was built up with the first shoe ever the adidas easy 750 boot crazy hype goes for i think about three thousand dollars now as they progress every new model ends up having a little more quantity because the hype's been created and now they need to supply the market because they know they're gonna sell so these shoes cost 220 dollars at retail but only a handful of people managed to cop them at retail because it's so incredibly hard to get and right out the store they sell at variations of three four and ten times the retail value these shoes were the latest new release and hence the their resale value is only about twice or thrice the retail so you could pick up a pair of cream whites for about $600 now and, and man they're beautiful shoes. But what you, don't see, what you see in photos is just this. What you don't see in the photos is the detail and the thickness of the lace in these beautiful three stripes and this comfortable back, this pull tab, the beautiful insole, the cushioning here which makes the shoe so goddamn comfortable. Oh my god. I hate the idea of models. But that's about it for today guys, thank you for watching, stay tuned, there's much cooler stuff coming, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, that's about it for today, good night.